What's up everybody, it's your boy T-Red Retro, so today I'm going to be coming testing two new turn-up drivers. Uh, one of them is turn-up 25.2.0 revision 3, that's this one, and the other one is the wind chime release, uh, this is 25.2.0 developed version. So we're just going to be testing both of them out, I'm going to put the link to where you can get both drivers inside the description. Um, the emulator I'm gonna be using is Eden and the settings that y'all gonna see me using it's gonna be the same settings for every game. So these are the settings I'm using. Sync and the shader will be on. And all these are defaults. So let's get it. Alright, so first game is Haru Warriors Age of Calamity. So this is one of the games that I'm trying to beat. The adjustments to the divine beasts are not yet complete. I already beat on um, not Tears of the Kingdom, but Breath of the Wild. That's a good Zelda game. And then gonna lie. Um, it's not getting good FPS. Now it's getting up there, it's going down. And this is the web child driver. Showing some graphical issues. So yeah, the web child um, driver is showing graphic issues and low FPS. Let me see if they're they gonna render. Nah. Yep. So this don't recommend this driver on this game. Alright, now it's rendered every nah. It's getting it better FPS, but the graphics not good. Cause it's getting solid 30. Alright, 
so next game alright so let's see how Red Dead Redemption gonna play with both drivers So it's getting good FPS right here in this area. But last time I tested this game out with a new driver, the FPS went down. So I'm just gonna go to this mission. So yeah, the FPS just dropped. Thank you for telling me all that back there. It must have been hard for you. Hope you understand now why I've been playing my cards somewhere close to my chest. I didn't know you were on a wife's and child. Then again, I don't think I ever asked. There are okay, the FPS just shot back up. Like I ain't so sure about that. And shot back down. And you can't see nothing for real. So it plays smooth, it don't feel like it's getting 15 FPS, but it keep on going up and down. Alright, so I'm just going to switch drivers. Alright, the web chain driver. Starting off smooth, starting off smooth. FPS going down as usual. say both of these drivers the same on this well you can see the characters more on this driver but they still disappear and reappear But this driver getting better FPS also, so I say this driver is a little bit better with this game. 
Alright, next game is Sonic X Shadow Generations. Shadows Generations is the hardest to emulate. FPS with this driver. Alright, now it just went up. Oh, crap. Alright, let me go over here. Alright, now let's see how this day is going to play. And it's not playing. Yep, crashes. So, next driver. Alright, so this driver feel like it's better. Don't crash, don't crash. You gotta be better than the other driver. Don't crash. And it look like it's gonna crash, yep. So both of them do the same thing with this game. All right, so last game. Run up. Who wants to go first? Easy work. Sweet the place. 
So yeah, we're getting low FPS, then it's going up. Alright, so let's test it out with the web channel driver. So with most of my testing, I say the web channel driver is a little bit better. Yeah, gameplay just more smooth over this driver. Open sesame. Let's see who I can whoop with this stick. So yeah, I say this driver is the best one to play for most games. Just come in some games if y'all want me to test out some more games. And I will. Y'all have a good day.